You know, I've gone through three script drafts and have come to only one goddamn conclusion. Fuck this game. It's not worth my time. It's not worth me getting all cleaned up, doing my hair, getting all prettied up with my makeup, getting dressed all fancy, and then sitting down to film myself bitching about a game, all of which taking more time than what the game offered me. Just doing my hair and makeup alone took longer than a single playthrough on Hard did for Hellbound, and between the amount of time I've spent writing alone, Space Marine has left me with less playtime. I've got 5 hours and 40 minutes on record, and 40 of those minutes were spent sitting there trying to get into a multiplayer game. And the latter isn't the game's fault, it's a 9 year old game after all. So no, Relic Entertainment, you don't get full chaos battle regalia, you don't get funny little script with me doing a shitty voice, you don't even get a fucking shark week. All you get, nay, all you fucking even attempted to earn is my pure, unfiltered vitriol. Check it the fuck out! Warhammer 40k, Space Marine, what the absolute fuck can I say about this game that isn't already spelled out in excruciating detail by the fact that the in-game title drop features a blurry fucking logo. And no, that's not a result of me downscaling the video, it was blurry in native resolution too. The tale of Titless Androgynous and his best friend, stupid ancient fuck, responding to a Xenos invasion that mysteriously only features orcs and their attempt to thoroughly unfuck the situation on Forge World Gryia. The story is short and stupid, featuring a zombie inquisitor who drops multiple hints that something with him isn't right. But hey, the medically and technologically enhanced intelligence of the Astarte just isn't enough to pick up on the shit I picked up on almost immediately. The end result of their stupidity is that they end up opening a warp gate and the good guys, led by Nemeroth, show up to spread the good word. Fucking great! This would be a kick-ass story if all of this didn't play out over the course of three excruciating hours with two more of a horrendous goddamn slog left to go. Hey! You! Yeah, you! You incredibly sexy fuck who accidentally stumbled upon this video! Do you want to play an Ultramarine? Do you want to play a nearly genetically perfect living weapon of world fucking? Too goddamn bad, because despite the fact that you aren't wearing Terminator armor, you lumber around at a goddamn snail's pace through endless fucking corridors with nary a fucking thing to shoot at for roughly 75% of the game. And don't fucking worry, when the combat has the decency to show up, you'll just end up wishing to go back to the boring hallways. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, the combat fucking sucks! Not only are you slow, lumbering and have the turning radius the size of an Olympic swimming pool, but everything dances from sluggish and unresponsive to jerky and unwieldy. Aiming guns is painfully slow, swinging melee weapons is jerky, and Tiffany randomly targets, causing you to regularly miss what you're aiming at. Projectile weapons also hit like snow, with enemies in no way even reacting to being shot unless it auto-kills them or puts them into the press button for cinematic kill mode. That's right! Contextual input kills, or as we would know them today, glory kills. They're how you regenerate health. They're incessantly long, and you can still take damage during them, resulting in me dying multiple fucking times after mistakenly thinking it was the last enemy, and now mashing B to regain health is taking way too fucking long, it's uncancelable, and I just have to sit there while a fucking green skin just trues through my entire fucking health bar. Upgrades are absolutely meaningless, and they don't improve your damage or your shield. They say that they do, but they come in conjunction with the introduction of enemies who drop your shield instantly, and enemies who take way more damage than anything else you've fought so far. It's shit. It's an endless tidal wave of shit that never feels good to play, never even makes me feel like I'm controlling a goddamn ultramarine, and has absolutely fucked my sense of humor and my drive to give this game any more time than I already have. And make no mistakes here, combat is absolutely entirely intolerable. Countless enemies being thrown at you all at once, constantly shouting SPICE MARINE at a rate that is mind-boggling fucked. I heard orcs shouting Space Marine over each other at a near constant rate, to the point that by the second hour I had heard them shout it more times than the most common of pawn dialogues in 200 hours of Dragon's Dogma. It's fucking awful, and it makes me want to kill myself. And yes, people who enjoy 40k, you heard that right. The orcs refer to you as Space Marine, something that they have no real concept of and completely eschewing their standard dialogue of Hume. Do you want to know what incompetence of the highest caliber looks like? Just look at the rotting husk of the Imperium's Mecha Christian Emperor. Want to know what the second highest caliber of incompetence looks like? Look no further. But Necro, you chaos-forged deity of consumer advocacy and infinite fucking, since you like to sneak in assessments of how much a game would be worth given what they bring to the table, how much would you say it would cost to make it worth playing? I fucking got it for free! 
and I want my goddamn money back! In the grim darkness of the far future, there are apparently only shitty games, and I just want to play a fucking decent one for once. Eat an entire bucket of dicks, Horus did nothing wrong, accept the primordial truth, or perish. I'm the Necro Swanson, and you can go fuck yourselves.